We're going to Zurich, Switzerland. Forget what you think you know about Switzerland. Zurich's got an edge. It's a city where medieval history collides with modern art and high finance, where you can swim in crystal clear water in the heart of a bustling metropolis. And trust me, the food, it's serious business. We're diving headfirst into the heart of Zurich. This is Zurich unveiled. Let me tell you something about Zurich. It knows how to live. Where else can you find a beach smack dab in the middle of a thriving city? Crystal clear water, people swimming, sunbathing, having a damn good time. This is where the locals come to unwind, to soak up the sun, to take a dip after work. This is Zurich, unfiltered and unapologetically alive. All right, let's talk food. You can't come to Zurich and not dig into some traditional Swiss grub. Today we're having Zürcher Geschnitzeltes, veal in a creamy white wine sauce with mushrooms. This dish has been around for centuries, a testament to the city's rich culinary history. It's real, it's honest, and it's damn good. Every city has its secrets, its hidden histories whispered in the stones. In Zurich, those whispers lead us to, insert the name of the historical site. This place has seen it all, wars, revolutions, the rise and fall of empires. It's a reminder that even in a city as modern as Zurich, the past is always present, shaping the present and whispering to the future. Markets, the beating heart of any city. And Zurich's market is a sensory overload in the best possible way. The colors, the smells, the sounds, it's a symphony of life. This is where the city comes to life, where strangers become friends over a shared love of good food and good company. If you want to see a city truly come alive, catch it during a festival. And Zurich? They know how to throw a party. The streets are a riot of color, music spills out from every doorway, and the air crackles with energy. It's a reminder that beneath the polished surface of any city lies a primal need to celebrate, to connect, to let loose. Sometimes you need to step back, to gain a new perspective. And there's no better way to see Zurich than from the deck of a boat gliding across Lake Zurich. The city unfolds before you, a tapestry of old and new, of nature and urbanity. This is Zurich in all its glory, serene, breathtaking, and utterly unforgettable. Name of the street. Remember that name, because this is where you want to be when the sun goes down. This street is a microcosm of Zurich itself, stylish, sophisticated, and with an undercurrent of excitement. This street is Zurich's catwalk, a place to see and be seen. You can't truly know a city until you understand its art, its soul. And in Zurich, that journey takes us to, name of the museum. This isn't just a collection of dusty artifacts, it's a conversation with history, a glimpse into the heart and mind of Swiss culture. This is more than just a museum visit, it's a pilgrimage. Even a concrete jungle needs its green lungs, and Zurich has plenty. We're at, name of the park, a sprawling oasis of green in the heart of the city. This isn't just some manicured lawn with a few benches, it's the perfect place to escape the urban chaos to reconnect with nature, to breathe. As the sun dips below the horizon, painting the sky in hues of orange, pink, and purple, the city of Zurich transforms into a canvas of breathtaking beauty. The golden hour casts a magical glow over the skyline, creating a serene and picturesque scene that captivates the heart and soul. We find ourselves at, name of the viewpoint, a vantage point that offers an unparalleled view of the city. From here, the sprawling urban landscape unfolds before our eyes with the majestic Alps in the distance adding to the grandeur of the scene. This is where the city comes to say goodnight, where locals and tourists alike gather to witness the day's final moments. Families, friends, and couples find solace in the shared experience, creating a sense of community and connection. To reflect on the day gone by and dream of the day to come, the air is cool, carrying with it the gentle whispers of the evening breeze. As the sun sets, it leaves behind a trail of memories and aspirations, a reminder of the beauty that each day holds. The city lights twinkle like a million fireflies, illuminating the streets and buildings with a soft, enchanting glow. The transition from day to night is seamless, as Zurich embraces the twilight with grace and elegance, and the silence is broken only by the gentle hum of the city below. The distant sounds of laughter, conversations, and the occasional car passing by create a symphony of urban life a melody that is both soothing and invigorating. It's the perfect end to our Zurich adventure, a journey filled with discovery, wonder, and unforgettable moments. As we stand here taking in the beauty of the sunset, we are reminded of the magic that lies in the simple pleasures of life, a moment of quiet contemplation. In this tranquil setting we find peace and clarity, a chance to pause and appreciate the world around us. The sunset over Zurich is not just a visual spectacle, but a profound experience that touches the heart and soul, leaving us with a sense of fulfillment and gratitude. Zurich, you surprise me. You're not just a pretty face, a city of banks and boutiques. You're a city with a pulse, a city that knows how to live, to eat, to celebrate. You're a city of contrasts, where ancient history collides with modern art, where nature thrives amidst the urban jungle. I found a city that's both familiar and exotic, sophisticated and down to earth. So, until next time, Zurich. Keep it real, keep it weird, and keep that fondue warm.